Hi everyone, I'm Tony from Russia. If you watch it, then you wonder how things work. Today we will continue to analyze the Jane Makibe video. So let's jump right to the part 2. Let's dance. This is a good scene with time control and layers. Two dancers on sides were cut off with masks and slowed down. Do you remember our dancing man from the part 1? Two layers, but on that one we will do time stretch. To make the movement smooth, you need to use a camera with the ability to shoot a large number of frames per second. The larger frame rate number, the slower things can be. Or use plugin to slow down the footage. For example, Twixter. 16. The eyes are the mirror of the soul. This is a good effect created without any need to create effects in post-processing. You need to find the right shooting angle to avoid the reflection of the camera. I like the off-screen meaning the child lives in an adult man. 17. Wire snakes. Another effect requiring a minimum of work in post-processing. Spread out the wires. Pull them out of the frame and reverse the static image sequence time. 18. Dancing girl and boxes. The girl performed a dance on a static camera against the wall. Then we need to take several photos from the same point without the girl, where in each frame we will change the number of boxes and replace the background behind the girl with a photo with the boxes and this fashionable guy. Also add a zoom out effect to make the frame more dynamic. 19. Tree transition. Growing buildings will not surprise us anymore. We considered them early in part 1. But the transition to the next scene is interesting. The contour of the tree creates a mask. Place this layer on top of the previous one. So the tree became a kind of patch for two layers. 20. A shot through the clear glass bowl. Only 3.99 on AliExpress. 21. Mirror forest. There are two layers taken from the same point. One is just trees, and the other is the same place with Jane. Then cut the horizontal middle of the first layer with the mask, and apply the mirror effect in After Effects. Change the reflection angle to 90 and increase the mask extension to hide the stitching line. Easy and effective. 22. One man team. This is several layers of one man shooted in different positions and stitched together. And one visual center. Basketball hoop. 23. Talking head. Nice idea was to rotate the camera. The lips of this head is a frame-by-frame frame animation, and the frame-by-frame frame animation is always cool. You can do something like this in many ways, like drawing on a piece of paper or in Photoshop. 24. Bottles and a boy. These are two different layers. The bottles are a set of static frames. It took a good and near assistant to fill them properly, and the man behind the camera taking a picture for each bottle state. And the boy in right part was taken from the same point. It turns out two scenes in one frame. Stop motion and real time. 25. Circles on the floor. Nice colors. For us, the place has already done part of the work and drew the correct projection angle. I'm sure you know that the square projection looks like this. What do we see here? The platform consists of lines, which shows us the desired angle. It remains to create a circle and rotate it along the x-axis so that it coincides in the direction with our place. It remains to add a mask at the intersection with the object and animate the scale parameter. 26. Infinity Bouncing Bolts I quickly created a simulation with the surface and the ball. We need a point from the start of movement, where the ball speed on top is zero, and until the movement, where it's zero again, thus when the Earth will extinguish the movement at the time of the rebound. Like this. I duplicate this layer 
and reverse it. Done. Mirror roofs. Same effect as we saw with number 21, mirror forest. 27. Curious giraffe. Fun effect with lengthening the neck. I will try to make the neck even longer. Create a quick mask around the neck. I will precompose this layer and go inside to make the composition size smaller. Later you will understand why. Now I will go back and then will throw the mesh warp effect on it. In the settings, the 3x3 grid. This effect allows you to deform the target layer. We reduced the composition so that the effect lay only on this area. I will create a keyframe for distort mesh. Go ahead and stretch the neck. Between the layers, I will create a sky color shape to cover the unnecessary part of the frame. Done. 28. Hanging Jane. Do not worry, she was out of danger. Jane was not here and not high. Then she was masked out, reduced, and placed over here. 29. Freeze pose. Layers and masks. Let's take this part. Let's say I want to freeze that pose. Copy this layer and find a frame to freeze. On this layer, right click, time, freeze frame. We're almost done. Take a pen tool and draw a mask. Switch on visibility of a lower layer. Press play. What is interesting here, they used several different shots with the same dance in one scene. Over here you can see a size and background changes. 30. Wavy road. Nice and pretty complicated effect, which can be achieved in various ways. For example, by deforming a picture of an asphalt in 3D editor inside After Effects, you can do this the same way we did with the Curious Giraffe. Duplicate the layer and freeze the frame. Let's create a mask based on an asphalt contour. and precompose it. Call it road. Go inside this comp and adjust the height of the composition to cut off all what we do not need. Let's go back and place the road layer where it should be. Apply the mesh warp effect to the layer with the following settings. Rows 10, columns 1, quality 10. Next, we need to create a keyframes for distortion mesh and create waves step by step, choosing points along the horizont through the clamped shift. Retreating, for example, 5 frames, return the points to their place and move the next ones. Here's what we have in a hurry. and anime scale property to add dynamic. Third one and finally, painting on zebra. Yes, they really repainted the zebra, but they did it in post-processing. Jane only runs a clean brush on zebra strips, simulating drawing. The real strips can be erased in Photoshop and using the tracking tools applied to the same scene with animated mask around the arm. Motion tracking is a big and interesting topic. I will talk about it one day. Do you have any interesting videos to make a set of tutorials on it? Write down in comments below. That's it. Thank you for your attention and impatience. Your support is the main engine for what I do. I'm Tony from Russia. Cheers, спасибо.